Right, we're up to part C of example one, and this one's going to be our difficult question. All right, March 2018 had 25% less rain than in March 2017. So let's look at that. March 2018, we already know how much rain fell then, 321. And it's 25% less than what happened in March 2017. I can't seem to write 2017 today. Okay, 2017. Um, so we don't know how much fell in 2017. But we know that March, which had 321, this is 25% less than question mark. Right? So what we've got to do is we've got to find 25% of question mark and subtract it to find 321. So once again, this is one of those ones where you're decreasing or increasing by a certain amount, but you don't know the amount that you're, um, you start with. Okay, and this is where we've got to use the four boxes rule. So four boxes. And one represents, so I've done two boxes anyway. One column represents March 2018 and the other one represents March 2017. All right, let's get our other two boxes here. And what I've done these in blue. I don't know why I'm just changing colors. So in March 2018 there were 321 there was 321 mils of rain. In March 2017 we do not know. All right. But um, what's happened is it's 25% less rain in 2018. So we're actually going to put 75% this time and March is going to be 100%. Notice wherever we start or wherever the question mark is, is where the 100% goes. And 25% less than that is 75%. So if we can figure out what we're multiplying by, we can solve this. Alright, and it's as simple as just going a little to the left and going, what's 321 divide 75? Comes out at 4.28, which means I'm timesing by 4.28. Alright, now it doesn't hurt to check it. Just go, alright, what's 75 times 4.28? It's 321, so I've got the right number. And 100 times 4.28 is 428. All right, so how much rain fell in March 2017? 428 millimetres.